So some people have been asking for me to make a new video on Atomic Bot because the old video is kind of outdated because of new features and different things being updated on the bot. So that's what this video is for. So this bot will let you use unreleased and released skins in your lobby and you'll be able to use every skin and every emote ever released into the game and you'll be able to show them to your friends if you want to. So to get this lobby bot, what you want to do is join our Discord server. The link will be in the description. And then once you've joined the Discord server, scroll down over here to this channel called Create Atomic. And then in this channel, you want to type in A exclamation point start. And then once you send that in, you should wait a few seconds. And then you'll see in the top left of your Discord, you'll get a DM. So just click on that. And then once you click on it, it'll give you a control panel. So now what you want to do is first you want to go over to the Epic Games website. And then if you've not already, you want to create yourself a alt account on Epic Games. So not your main account, but a secondary account that is different from your main account. So I've already created one. It's called Atomic Bot Video 2. And I'm going to be using this one for the bot. And if you've not already created this one, all you have to do is create an account in Epic Games. It's pretty simple. If you don't know how to do that, just look up a video and you can create that account. So make sure that account is logged in on your browser and you can do this on your phone or on a computer. So now you can just go back into the Discord and you wanna click on the second link. So just click here and then that'll take you to a page that looks like this. So it's gonna have this huge string of letters. So what you wanna do is just copy the entire thing and then you wanna go into here and you wanna just paste it in just like that and then send that in there. And again, you can do this on your phone as well. And then once you've done that, it'll create your Lollibot and you're done. Now you have your Lollibot and you can do all of these commands on the Lollibot. So you'll see up here, it'll say the Lollibot's name after this thing right here. So you'll see the Lollibot's name is right there. So the next thing you wanna do is open up Fortnite on whatever device you wanna use. You can do this on a console, on a phone, or on a PC. And you can do this on any device that can run Fortnite. And then you want to go over to the friends menu right here and you want to add the bot as a friend. So to do that, just go over here. If you're on PC, you can copy it or you can just type it in if you're on another device and then go on into here and then paste it in and then you can add the friend. So I'm already friends with this bot, so I'm not going to be doing that step. But if you're not friends with the bot, just add the bot over here and it'll automatically accept your friend request. So now that you have the bot friended, it should appear in your friends menu. So what you want to do is click over here and then click on invite to party, just like this. And then if you go back into here, it should say, should I accept this invite? So just click on yes, if that is you, and then it will join your party. So you can see that the bot is now in my party. So now what you want to do is click on the bot, click on manage, click on party leader and make the bot party leader, and then head back into the discord and do a exclamation point hide and that will hide your player in the lobby so that you can only see the bot so this is really useful for things like tiktok youtube videos where you want to showcase under these skins and you don't want to show your actual account in the lobby with this bot so now that you have the bot in your lobby you can do any commands that you want with it so the first command that you might want to do is you can see that the level is 999. If you want to change that to something that's more realistic, just do a exclamation point level. And then you can do something like maybe 50. And then that'll make the level on the bot change to 50. And that is what it's going to do. And then if you want to change the skin from this skin to something else, then all you have to use a exclamation point skin. And then you can type in the skin name. So if you want to do something like Spider-Man, just type in Spider-Man, make sure to include the dash, and then you'll be able to get the Spider-Man skin. So if you go back into here, it has changed to the Spider-Man skin. And then you'll see the Spider-Man has a backpack. And if you want to take away that backpack, do A exclamation point backpack, and then do none. And then that will take away the backpack. You can also type A backpack clear. Both of those will work and you can see that there is no backpack anymore. So now that you have the red Spider-Man, you might want to change this to something like the different variants of the Spider-Man. So if you go down here, you can see that there is a symbiote version of Spider-Man. So if you want to change into the symbiote version of Spider-Man, what you want to do is go back into here, do a exclamation point style, and then type Spider-Man. 
And what this is going to do is it's going to let you choose from the different versions of Spider-Man. So you can do, there's four different versions. So if you want to change it to the symbiote, there's actually six different versions. So if you want to change it to the symbiote suit, just type in two. So it says press two to equip and then press enter. And then it should equip the symbiote version of Spider-Man. And you'll see that we have the symbiote version of Spider-Man now in our lobby. And then if you want to get something like this one, all you have to do is type that exact same thing again. And if you want to get their Gilded Reality one, then you just have to type in six once that one appears. So just wait for it, and you'll see that it has this option. So you can just type in six, and that'll give you the Gilded Reality version of Spider-Man. So this is like a golden version of Spider-Man, so that's pretty cool. And you have that all in your lobby. So now if you want to make the bot do something like an emote, then just type in A exclamation point emote, and then you can make it do any emote that you want. So if you want to make it do something like the floss, just type in floss, and that'll make it do the flossing emote right here. And now you have a flossing emote on your Spider-Man skin. So there's a few more commands that I'll be showing, and then the rest I'll just be describing, and I'm not going to be showing them. So the first one is going to be the pink ghoul command. So this is a shortcut if you want to instantly get the pink ghoul or the purple skull trooper. So if you want to get the pink ghoul trooper, you just do pink ghoul, just like this. And then that will get you instantly the pink ghoul trooper without having to do any special styles commands. So you can get the OG pink ghoul trooper, like this. And then if you want to get the purple skull trooper just do a exclamation point purple skull and that'll get you and that will get you the purple skull trooper and then if you want to do any of these party commands all of these will work so you can do the ready command and this will make the bot appear as if it's ready in the party so if you do a exclamation point ready this will change the bot to ready up here and then if you want to do unready just type in unready and that'll make the bot unready right here. And if you want to make the bot say something, you can just do a exclamation point say, and then just say something like hi, and then that'll send a message into the chat right here. And you'll be able to use this if you want to troll people by making the bot talk or do anything like that. So if you have any other questions about the bot, feel free to go into the Discord server and then go over to the help ticket and you can create a ticket to ask questions to any of the helpers in our server and we'll be happy to help you thank you guys so much for watching if you want to keep up to date with the newest videos on the channel make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications and i'll see you guys in the next one